they're, they're, they're trying to get this thing called Prop 60, which is basically going to make it, make it, a. Uh, have nicknamed it the Steve Lubsy Law, because uh, <laughs> it's going to let all these perbs like him go out and uh, stalk these porn stars. So uh, it, it it'll be quite the uh, it'll be quite the quite the thing if this thing passes. Uh, so we'll be talking to him. Uh, also, uh, Mister Forty, Forty Foe may be in the building very soon. I sent him a, a text. I said, "Hey, uh, we ready? <laughs> Whenever you're ready." <laughs> so I, I I I don't know. He was supposed to be with us today. Who knows if this is actually uh, gonna take place? Uh, I've, I've sent him a Facebook message as well. I've, I've heard, uh, zero. So, <laughs> what do you, uh, hell, who knows? Maybe, I don't maybe. know. 40, wherever you at, man, you better get your butt <laughs> over here, bro. I don't know what you're doing, man. Get out the Cody. Just get out of it. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, then of course, next Sunday, uh, it is, it is going to be interesting. It is the 23rd of, uh, October. And uh, we will be talking with some XWE guys. I don't exactly know um, if we're gonna ha- if we're gonna be uh, graced by the presence of Blade, or if uh, he will, uh, you know, just accept the challenge but never show up. Uh, I I don't exactly know what is going on, so we uh, we we sh- we shall see. Uh, what takes place next Sunday on this radio program. And uh, uh, Kevin Sieg was supposed to come by today, too. I haven't seen him. Uh, the Electric Grandpa, as he calls himself now. I think he's the Electric Grandpa now. <laughs> I, I, I don't exactly know if that's... <laughs> what makes Grandpa so electric, man? <laughs> <laughs> I, I have no clue. I need to understand that. I don't Supposedly, understand he was going to come by today, and whenever he comes by, he always has... Uh, a huge collection of plunder that he brings with him. He, he brings his uh, his giant keyboard, his keyboard stand. He brings a, a an, an old school kitchen chair that he sits <laughs> on when he uh, when he plays his music, and uh, he he usually has all sorts of interesting things to say about politics and the military uh, and uh, I know who you're talking and, about. <laughs> I know all, who you're talking about. So it should. Who know knows? <laughs> who knows if he'll actually make an appearance uh, yeah. today? But uh, we we shall see, as they say. Yeah. Um, also, like I said, top of the hour here in about thirty minutes. Uh, Eric Paul Lee on Skype. He will join us from Los Angeles about uh, this porn star law, or as I've nicknamed it, the Steve Lovesy law. And uh, Skylo with us today. Kane, What's Gator up, Crush. Man? Uh, we heard a little Gator Crush earlier. We're going to play some more Gator Crush uh, as we move forward. In fact, why don't we do that real quick? And uh, we'll, we'll take a break and play some Gator Crush. Uh, what two tracks you want to, you, you, you think people need to need to hear about so we can uh, get the ball rolling here? I, um, you can hit them with uh, In My Zone. Because I, cause I've, uh, there it is, In My Zone. What's the other one? And what else you got up there? One more time. I got not afraid to shoot, tear the city up. Tear the city up. Tear the city up. Tell, tell me a little bit about these tracks before we play them. Oh, uh, they they basically uh, in my zone is basically ba- what it is is me being in my zone, going off, spitting how I want to spit, feeling like how I want to feel. So <laughs> that's what that is. And tear the city up is basically an an anthem for those out there, true hip hop heads, man. That's so, cool. That's what it is. Well, that's man. cool. It's, it's, it's how everybody feel at some point in their life. They just want to tear something up. So 